My name is Stanley Lexan and I am the owner of Evangelic Comics. I'm sitting here today to talk to you about three things. Cordae Bonds, Photosynthesis, and Gravitron. Now I know Gravit they call Gravitron, you know, something else. His name is a little bit slightly different. But y'all guys got to uh, forgive me about Britney's supervillain name because I really don't know how to say her superhero name that well. And then I want to talk to y'all guys about Kavay and Bonds. Now, this is going to be like a seven-minute video. All right, now, let's jump right into it. My thoughts about Kavay and Bonds is that she didn't really have, like, she could fly. Well, she couldn't fly, she could float. Like, she used her powers because she had the powers to manipulate water. Even though I didn't say that in the actual, like, story, I just said she had water powers, but one of her powers is to manipulate water. Now, what she does, how she floats, like, how she flies, basically, is that she puts the water around her legs, and then she uses her manipulation powers to carry her in the sky. Now, Kavea Bonds has like the power, like her power, like her water blasts are really strong because as you saw in the, uh, the story that she, she blasted photosynthesis through the sky. Now, her, like it's no comparison to like, if y'all guys know anything about a fire truck hose, she, like the force of a fire truck holes has no comparison on Kavayet Bond's water pressure. Like Kavayet Bond's water pressure can actually pierce through a tank easily. Like she's very, she has a very strong water pressure and she could like, it's like tidal waves. Like she, she you know, she is very powerful. Uh, like I said, she is going to end up having more powers. Like, I'm going to eventually tell y'all guys, like, through the story, I don't want to spoil anything. But going into Britney now, photosynthesis, like, she's a flower. This is how her power works. She is a woman that can manipulate and create oxygen, sunlight. Uh, she could take in sunlight. She has solar energy power. She has fire powers. She has like, she can do a lot of stuff pertaining actually like the photosynthesis. She has, she can manipulate the photosynthesis. And she is really based on a flower. So that's why like she needs the sunlight for her skin to retain its um, natural her natural like vitamins or whatever you want to call it like photosynthesis also have like is you know has very strong wind powers as well like that is one of her main things in the story right now is that she has like her wind powers even though like I said I didn't talk about it really in the story but she's going to be coming out with her side story not soon but She's going to have her own little side story, and I'm going to talk more about all these characters. Uh, Gravitron, he has, he's super strong and destructible. Um, he has the power to manipulate uh, gravity, making it lighter or heavier. He also is like, he, but he can manipulate it like completely. Like, he's a very, he's very strong. Like, Kavea Bonds couldn't, like, as strong as I said Kavea Bonds' water pressure is, he could withstand it for a certain amount of time, actually, before he even get knocked off his feet. And that's at her strongest. Like, that's what she's giving at her all. So, like, the story was about Grammar Tribe, the government, Somebody from the government had killed his family and he was going out after the guy who killed his family. As you see in the story. The other story with uh, photosynthesis, you know, to give a quick a quick recap, 
um, photosynthesis, photosynthesis was jealous of Kamea Bonds because photosynthesis think that she is the number one woman in the world's eyes. And, you know, nobody can, no woman can be compared to her, prepare, whatever, you, however you say it. But, uh, Kamea Bonds, like, she's a pure-hearted, kind-hearted woman. You know, she's a daycare teacher. She loves kids. And the first, that's the first thing on her mind is to be jealous or envy of anyone. Like, she's really a great superhero in every way. And I'm going to, like, show more of her story off. But... I got other people's stories coming out right now, like the outcast ones. Um, the outcast ones are the next ones that I'm planning on putting out. So, y'all guys, like, just stay tuned. I told y'all it was going to be a short one. But before I go, before I go, I could say that um, Kamea Boss, she's half black, half white. Um, she's around... I'm going to say at the time, 30 to 32 years old. Brittany is Caucasian American. You know, she has green eyes, blonde hair. She is, um, you know, like she is a supermodel. Well, Miss America. She's not a super, she's Miss America. But uh, like I said, she's Caucasian. And then you have Nathan. Nathan is a black man, black African American, um, like six foot, he's around six foot two, six foot three, weighs about 200 and like what, 200, I say 230 to 240 pounds, like he's cocky with it too, he's like a cocky guy, and photosynthesis is Around like I say, she's also around like what like five eleven, five five ten five eleven. Um, Kavaya Bonds is not too far from that. Like she's around five ten, also like five nine five ten, just a couple inches shorter than photosynthesis. Um, the news reporter, I can't think of her name right now, but she is Hawaiian. And uh, she's half Hawaiian and half white. And uh, I don't want to spoil anything, but she just notice she's going to be a big part of Kaveh Bonds' story. It's going to be more about her. So the next villain for Kaveh Bonds is going to be Virus. But I'm not going to say anything about that. I'm just going to leave it at that. This is it. I'm signing out. And I will show y'all guys their powers one day. Like, I'm going to show it on paper or something. Like, not on paper, but I'm going to show it in a video and show them, like, their actual powers for y'all guys can, like, just sit and listen to it. But until then, I'm out.